Hello Umut here, welcome to another video. Today I'm going to work on my mini art journal. Uh, you know I do mini pages uh, to practice some colors, uh, to relax, uh, do little things uh, in shorter time. Uh, and today I'm going to work on uh, a new page, a little page here, not a double page, uh, because uh, I want to do something quick and uh, nice. I will use these two girly colors today. One is Cherry Pie from Dilutions, the other is uh, Funky Fuchsia. I will just uh, mix them, blend them uh, with my uh, sponge here. This is a simple makeup sponge. I'm just uh, covering the other pages not to uh, spread the colors. If you haven't watched my uh, art mini art journals before, uh, I do this when I want to create something quick and I share it with you. I think it's useful for beginners as well because I do less things, uh, less colors uh, and little page so it's uh, much easier to learn. Uh, and uh, for me I enjoy it a lot uh, because uh, it's very rewarding in a very short time. I have two other videos that I'm going to link down below. Uh, I did a mini art journals. After I finish my blending, I will give some interest to the background. I'm using this stencil that I did myself at home with my digital cutter. But I'm sure there are similar things out there or any stencil, any stamp is fine. It's just to give some more interest to the background, not to leave it plain. Uh, I'm using the same two colors, uh, using my sponge, I'm going over the stencil. Uh, as you see, it's a tone-on-tone -tone look. I will uh, continue from stencils. Uh, this is a deco art uh, stencil. Uh, it's Andy Skinner uh, creation. And uh, I will also use this uh, for my sentiment. This time it will be big. I will use this create one and I found it quite interesting. I'm using my Nuvo embellishment mousse uh, to go over this uh, to create my sentiment and it will be also raised which will be a nice uh, interest as well. Nuvo mousse is actually wax but you can use it like this as well. Uh, it's multifunctional, you use it for many things. Uh, so I'm going over this with my spatula. I love this color, it's cor coral and uh, it goes uh, very well with the background color. Makes it pop, uh, that's why I chose it. I, I really like it. Uh, so now I'm going to use it as a wax and create a little bit border. Uh, and uh, I want the rest of the page to have some kind of shimmer as well, uh, to have some harmony. I'm going around the edges with my finger. When I feel it's too much, I can clean it with my baby wipe always. And uh, I will put some other elements. I love this uh, scrapbook paper. It's Wildflower Collection from Kaiser Craft. And I chose these two butterflies that has the colors that are already on my page. And I am putting a little bit shimmer, again using my mousse, uh, to my butterflies. Again, this will also uh, help uh, unify all, all the page, uh, having the same elements uh, in each element. I am sticking it with my matte medium only in the center so that the rings are in the air it also gives a nice dimension a little one final touches i'm using my sparklets again from kaiser craft uh, in the middle this is uh, this collection is coral colors uh, so it again goes with my page i'm sticking it uh, in the middle of my butterflies and finally, to bring things together, I'm putting a little bit of my mousse uh, on my craft mat and I'm spraying some water 
to dilute it and I'm going to do some splashes as you can guess. Uh, I exaggerated a little bit so I'm cleaning some of it. So my page is finished, this little page, uh, quick and easy. Uh, I hope you like it. I love the colors, uh, very girly. Thanks for visiting my channel and watching the videos. If you like them, don't forget to give thumbs up or subscribe to my channel if you haven't already. You will find the list of uh, supplies down below at the description area or in my blog. Thanks for watching and see you next time. Thank you.